In this training video, we'll show you how to create a mathematical user-defined variable. In this example, we'll take the variable monthly cell phone bill, which was originally uploaded with the data set, and we'll multiply it by 12 to generate a new variable called annual cell phone spending. We'll start by clicking on the new item and choosing mathematical variable. We'll call this new variable annual cell phone spending and we'll put it in the general usage category, which is where the monthly cell phone bill variable is. Next, we'll define the calculation for our new variable. To do that, we'll choose different variables, constants, and operators in this section, which will enable us to build the definition that will appear in this box below. The first item we want to choose is the monthly cell phone bill, which is a variable as opposed to a constant, so we'll leave that as it is. Next, I type the word bill and hit enter. This will bring up the monthly cell phone bill variable in this dropdown. Next, click add to definition to move this variable to the box below. Now what we need to do is turn this into an annual figure. So we'll multiply it by 12. First by selecting the multiplication symbol here. And then by inserting the constant 12. To get the 12 into this box, first choose the constant option type in 12, and then click Add to Definition. So there's our very simple math UDV. It's the monthly cell phone bill times 12, and that will give us our annual spending. Now, if I wanted to make any changes to this, I could select any one of these clauses within the statement and either edit it the way I created it or remove it from the expression. I can also undo my last change. It's right just the way it is, so we're going to click OK. And that's all there is to it. Now we have this new mathematical UDV, and it appears on the variable list in the general usage category. And we can see the values that were created for this new variable here. Now this variable is ready for use in a crosstab or any other market site item. That concludes this training video on mathematical UDVs.